The world is a ravenous gauntlet that begins oh so young. This little fella is completely unaware that he's about to enter the modern day gladiators arena for toddlers. Daycare interviews. So we, his parents, are tasked to start him off with a solid victory. It's like we used to say in Gaffney. The hog that gets into the right college never becomes barbecue. This is gonna be a good year for us. I could drink you. Good thing I haven't pumped yet. Meet Linda Samsonite, owner of the most prestigious and sought after daycare in the entire metro area. Billionaire progeny have been rejected for something as simple as taking a crap on the floor and not in a toilet. Personally, I have a lot of respect for an animal who can't be broken. I wanted to tell you in private before the others arrived. We have only one slot available. Looks like we've got a good old fashioned dog fight on our hands. But with babies. I knew we shouldn't have trusted her. I didn't. I don't. I don't trust anyone. This process is too arbitrary for my blood. Sometimes winning by default is still a win. <coughs> oh no, his allergy. Isn't she magnificent? It's like we used to say in Gaffney. She'd be fun to have sex with. You didn't tell us Jeffrey had it. Meet the prize pedigree pony, Pippin Sandstone. Grooming a child for private daycare is not unlike grooming a horse to win the Kentucky Derby. Just the right amount of petting and pressure will get your horse to perform. Pippin's parents, Castor and Bella, bring a pedigree even we are envious of. Sandstone Health Foods ring a bell. Their organic products lie on our shelves and their baby poops golden granola. You know, Linda, he, he does yoga every day after nap time. Maybe we could donate some yoga mats. Um, a sound system for the chant music. Oh, my! <laughs> that sounds wonderful. Uh, hold that thought, Mr. and Mrs. Sandstone. Hello? Whose deposit bounced? Really, I am with the Sandstones right now. What do you mean it's not a surprise? It's not a surprise, because their products have been known to give people soupy runs. Their lawsuits abound. No, I know, I just work for your bank, but I thought you should know. Soupy runs. People don't like them. I am sorry, but I will not be able to make a decision today. As a daycare professional, soupy poop problems are a huge concern of mine. I will be in touch. Thoughts? Oh, I'm just planning how to make my scheme a reality. Is it all worth it? It is the premier daycare of this entire city. This is just step one. There'll be a lot of nights like this. Wait till you cut the corn on this one. It's like we used to say in Gaffney. Why the hell didn't I wear a condom?